Hey, what's up? Oh, uh, Jack was just fighting the after effects of a particularly nasty cold and doing some research for stone cold. Huh? Perhaps cold should be my password for the day. <laughs> Assuming she recalls, it's always best to answer. <laughs> Speaking of, Jason, um, I heard he and Sonny are still having problems with the Sakaras. Yes, the situation is ongoing and potentially lethal. Right, and Johnny's caught in the middle of it. They wouldn't actually target him, would they? Jackal is the guardian of many secrets, grand and small, and part of my worth is my ability to keep them. And a note of caution I shouldn't need to make, it is unwise to question the practices and procedures of Stone Cold and Mr. Corinthos. I get that, absolutely. I, I was just curious because I think it's an interesting dilemma that Sonny and Jason have. How so? Well... Johnny's being pulled into his father's business through no fault of his own, and the point I'm trying to make is that Johnny's landed squarely into the position of enemy to Sonny and Jason. Um, why does this matter to you? Johnny put his life on the line to save me and everyone else from his father at the ball. Uh, but, but no, hey, hey, if, if Sonny and Jason want to go after him anyway, that's part of the mob business, right? I mean, it's all about threats and, and territory and... Someone like Johnny, who has grown up in all of that, obviously knows the risks. So if he wants to take over Anthony's business and he dies in the process, what's another dead mobster? <laughs> who even cares? The blonde one seems to. Who no. think that I have feelings for Johnny? Well, sadly, it would appear to be so. I feel sorry for him. Sort of. I, I, I guess that I identified with him for a moment until I realized that Johnny is exactly where he wants to be. I mean, Johnny was his father's captor once upon a time, but now those days are long gone. He actually wants to be a mobster. He made that choice, so let him. And and I, I hope he's happy. And if he ties, well, sucks to be him. <laughs> Methinks the lady doth protest too much. What is that supposed to mean? Ah, just a random quote from the bard. Huh. The jackal never does anything randomly. Do for two of poor Charles's finest. We're investigating Emily Quartermain's murder, as well as the attack on Carly Jacks. We think there could be a link between the two crimes and the September murder of Letitia Juarez. Mm. Well, if this has got anything to do with Anthony Zakara, you know that he has been certified insane. And if he committed a crime before his unfortunate accident, I would have no knowledge of that. We're not here about Anthony. We need to verify John Sakara's alibis for all three incidents in question. At this point, none of the ones he gave holds up.